He's a North man. Ah, revenge. One of the great bedrocks of storytelling. Every human that has ever lived has felt that guttural, visceral, primitive instinct to repay someone that has wronged them with a proportionate, if not devastating response. And no matter how justified, it's always begged the question, was it worth it? This is a question asked by many a film with a variety of differing answers. This is a spoiler-free review. The Northman, the latest film by Robert Eggers, follows Omleth, played by Alexander Skarsgård, whose Norse chieftain father, Ethan Hawke, gets murdered by his brother, Fjolnir. Omleth escapes suffering the same fate and dedicates his life to avenging his father, saving his mother, and killing Fjolnir. First things first, Skarsgård is so built and jacked, somewhere Frank Grillo is blushing. If you see this dude coming at you, it's best to quickly make peace with the Allfather and get ready for Valhalla. I love that the movie didn't shy away from showing, albeit to various extents, the different brutal elements that went along in Viking culture. The murdering, pillaging, plundering. We witnessed these acts without a modern day voice of sensibility in the movie reminding us how awful it was. It's quite the immersive motion picture, which has become a hallmark of the director Robert Eggers. His previous movies, like The Witch, which popularized the slow burn atmospheric horror genre, genre, and The Lighthouse, which is so weird and abstract that I felt like I had gone insane watching it. Perhaps that was the point. This movie has a much more focused narrative than his previous works, but it's embedded with a lot of mind-bending Norse mythology. He clearly has a brilliant eye for cinematography, as the natural world the characters live in looks and feels real. Also, the battle sequences are all wide-angle, long shots, and not overly zoomed-in shaky cam, which I greatly appreciated. One complaint I have is, and this may just show how desensitized I am, but the movie tends to pull its punches when it comes to violence in its action scenes. When Skarsgård is going through a raid and axing fools left and right, it almost felt PG-13 at parts with its toned down gore effects. Whereas, there are some Robert Eggers style hard R parts in the movie when it comes to, let's say visuals as if Hannibal Lecter designed the bodies exhibit. Which tells me that Eggers detests the violence of war, but loves his true crime podcasts. Probably. I like this movie, although it's not for everyone. If you like The Witch or The Lighthouse and or a mysticism filled Viking revenge quest sounds like your chalice of mead, I definitely recommend it. I love the various themes and questions this movie asks. Not only the ones that had to do with revenge, but also lineage, sense of purpose, belief, destiny. It all made it feel human.